Everything you need to know about Yeet. Presented by Miraculous. Noah Oliver Smith, known professionally as Yeet, is an American rapper from Portland, Oregon. Born on February 26, 2000 in Irvine, California, which makes him currently 21 years old. His ethnicity is Mexican and Romanian. His mom is from Romania and his father is from Tijuana, Mexico. As far as his gender, he mentions on Twitter that his gender is a serpent. Growing up, Yeet would play soccer and basketball but never really got into the sports. He would later move from Oregon to New York after graduating high school in June 2018 because of the lack of a music scene in Oregon. His inspiration for music was sparked as a child because growing up his dad was in a band. Yeet grew up listening to T-Pain, Jay-Z, and Kanye but takes inspiration from artists like Feature and Young Thug. Yeet smoked weed for the first time at 15 years old. He mentions that he stopped smoking when he was living in New York because he felt like weed was making him unproductive and he would get too high. He started rapping late 2016 after a friend from high school had a studio in his room that opened up the opportunity to make music. His confidence in believing in his music is what motivated him to continue even though he said his early songs were bad. He mentions that he felt like music was destined for him and that anything was possible after an acid trip. Acid trips might be fun, but when he goes to the studio, his creative process sometimes consists of Percocets and ecstasy. When creating a song, he likes to punch in and freestyle. The music he makes draws inspiration on whatever he's going through in his life. Yi came up with his name after trying to come up with a name that was one word and something that people can feel like they've heard before. He started gaining traction at a very high pace when his song Sorry About That off his 4L project would go viral on TikTok. The song stood out because of the bell sound that was placed to make the song more turn. He would add the bell sound to make his music stand out, saying in an interview with Our Generation Music that he didn't know how to produce but when he would get a beat that a producer sent to him, he would go through and add bells. He said that he added the bells because they were alarming and would catch people's attention. Yeet was already on his way to success, but it wasn't until he would receive cosigns from huge artists in industries like Lil Uzi, Trippy Red, Playboy Cardi, and Drake that would put him in a different lane from his peers at the time. Drake would also post a story on Instagram listening to Yeet's song Get Busy and would reference his lyrics in the following posts. His work rate is intense. In the month of June 2021, he would create over 200 songs and depending on his mood and his schedule for the date, he can create up to 15 songs in one day. His projects that he put out usually consist of over 20 songs. The decision process of what gets put out comes down to what him and his team feel like are the most turnt songs. It was announced through his story that he signed a multi-million dollar deal with Interscope Records in October 2021. His popular saying Twizzy came after being in New York with his friend and wanting to invent a new word. The inspiration for creating a new word came from his father after hearing his dad and he was known for making up random words. Twizzy is another form of saying twin. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you did enjoy the video, make sure to hit that like button. Let us know in the comment section below what you'd like to see next. And if you haven't already subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. My name is Kevin Moore and I'm out. Peace.